We basically um, brought the name Bernardo because we've been such followers and believers of Bernardo footwear. And we saw it sort of be destroyed in the 70s and 80s. And we felt so strong about the line and had such faith in the line and thought what the man was doing. And just really wanted to take it back to its without changing his philosophy and starting at his basic uh, sandal and slowly building it up. But we found that. Um, this is the niche of Bernardo footwear. It used to be sandals. We're not trying to be anything to anybody except be what Bernardo was, which is flat sandals, um, non-restrictive footwear, not changing the shape of the foot, keeping the structure as its natural shape. No instep and just uh, a free foot. But try to keep with the, um, the trends as far as patterns, the trends as far as new materials, and just keeping it going, but keeping true to Bernardo Dolsky. Exactly. Here's an article in Life magazine that talks about how, in protest against the deforming harness, which modern man calls shoes, okay? And he created the whole idea of foot freedom. And he said that as a result of the fact that we have been really uh, kept and bound by the footwear that we've been wearing all those years, um, that we have all of these deformed feet now with corns and bunions. But this was in 1946 when he came out with that whole concept and created this the modern sandal that we know today. And really, it's, there really was no one else out there doing this at that time. And Jackie O was like one of the first women, I think, to buy the Miami and it was an overnight hit back then in the late 50s and 60s, just like for us when we started it in 2000. Um, Lily Pulitzer was also uh, another famous name for the Miami. And what's great is, you know, what shoe company is out there where the clients know the name of the shoe, the style name on the box, but everybody knows Miami. As soon as you say Bernardo, they say Miami, right? Miami. Second, it's Miami. Same thing, so. that's, that's how strong a following this sandal had. And we t tweaked it just a touch, you know, just to bring it up to today, and it's as successful today as it was back in the 50s and 60s.